For me, the coolest thing about this lens is the glass, the colors, the way it works with direct sunlight, the specular light coming through the elements. The colors are beautiful for something that's small and sleek. It's really nice. In terms of like the prime lens game for wide lenses, it'd probably be the first one I go to because of how sharp everything is. I really liked being able to have this like very artistic old style lens on a modern body that I'm more used to using and, and seeing what kind of um, images I could create with it. Sometimes I'm shooting with my body more than I am with my eye. I know that with the 17 millimeter focal length, this will capture everything that I need to uh, tell within that frame. And also it makes it kind of like more personal because you're like closer to the subject rather than being like far away with like a telephoto lens or you can take a step back and capture more in the frame that you normally couldn't. I really enjoyed the effect of the lens when I was a little bit below our model and the sky was much more dramatic. It just really gave a much more like a dreamy quality, this kind of soft but also vibrant look to the photos. Working with it at like chest level, it never dipped down. It just sat perfectly on in the middle of my chest, like pointing straight ahead to the point where with infinity focus, I could record from the hip really, if you will. I was able to be really discreet. I really liked the lens flares that I was getting playing with direct sunlight. I thought it was fun and easy because it was so light to, to move around and get really high resolution videos. I preferred the, the wheel not having the clicks. It's just this really simple glide to the aperture wheel. So I thought that was really fun and I was able to work quicker, honestly. I used it a lot uh, for slow motion. I was filming a lot at 60 frames per second and I was really impressed. Well, I think uh, the advantages of using this particular kind of lens is that you can really you know, get into tight spaces. You're trying to capture a scene. The depth of field preview, I feel like is like one of my favorite parts of this. Uh, particular lens. When you have your, your aperture uh, preview, you get to see you know, what the distance is of how you're going to shoot you know, without having to even look you know, through your, uh, your viewfinder. So I think that this is this what makes this you lens know, very special and it makes it a, you know, a very good you know, tool to photographers also. This is really great for shooting from the hip. Um, this lens will be great, especially going down to 2.8. It's definitely going to work in your favor. Maybe in, in a very low light situation, like it's going to gather all the light that it can and it's going to perform very very well. It looks incredible. It looks like a very like it's just like a classic look that like in my opinion never gets old. So what you find with other wide angle lenses is a lot of distortion, straight lines become curved and with a tall lens you don't find that basically at all. You won't be disappointed using this lens.